wizard of West LA here. I think I have solved one part of the ethernet problem on the phone. Here's what I had to do. There's my phone. What I had to use is a powered router, USB router, and that line is going to a, that is going to a lightning to USB connector. And what I'm using, I first tried this adapter, which is a, I tried this adapter, which is Ethernet to USB, which this didn't work. However, for my iPad, however, for my iPad, I had this laying around. I have this connector, which is a little, a, li a little hub, which has USB-C, uh, HDMI, another USB, and it has Ethernet on the side. Very useful thing. But the end of this is USB-C. So I got a little adapter to go from USB-C to USB, USB-3. And what I did is I plugged it in. So now, so now that I have it plugged in, let's look at the screen. I'm going to go, I'm going to power it. Now I power it. And now it says ethernet. Now let's go to ethernet. And we'll wait a little bit. Let's see what it does. There. I get an ethernet address. Look at that. It actually will work. So I'm gonna post the parts as best as I can. I'm gonna post this video in case you have other parts. Feel free to leave me some comments below and let me know what you find with other, uh, other parts of it. I'm going to post that adapter on USB-C and I have this powered hub you have to use a powered hub because if you try to hook that part into the phone, uh, which I did already, you will get an error that it doesn't uh, handle the, you know, it's excessive power. But this looks like it works. So let me know in the comments. Let me know what you find. And I'm going to post this and I'm going to post another updated video regarding this. So keep on learning.